गुड मॉर्निंग स्टूडेंट्स टुडे आई वांट टू टेल अबाउट अल्जेब्रिक एक्सप्रेशंस अल्जेब्रिक एक्सप्रेशंस एंड आइडेंटिटीज एक्सप्रेशंस एंड एंड आइडेंटिटीज so uh, when we are studying about all uh, iit foundation we should know these basics so what is algebraic expressions generally algebra means what uh, the algebra comes from arabic word algebra comes from arabic word comes from arabic word algebra a l j a b r i algebra means what uh, the reunion of broken parts the reunion of of broken parts so this is first uh, this uh, this is given by al khwarizmi al k h w a r z m i so al khwarizmi is a arabic uh, mathematician and uh, the father of algebra is considered to be Uh, generally in algebra what happens uh, the operation of literals algebra means the operation of generally we are uh, from 1 to 5th we will learn about numerical operations like 2 plus 3 2 into 3 or 2 by 3 or whatever it may do uh, but uh, in this uh, we will learn about uh, the operation of literals literals r r called algebra r j br by here the diophantus is considered as diophantus is considered as as the father of uh, as the father of of algebra algebra now we will uh, we have to learn some of the topics like terms factors coefficients what do you mean by terms we should know about the factors we should know about the coefficients so generally terms are added to form expressions algebraic expressions terms are r added to form algebraic expressions next uh, terms are uh, in the are formed uh, is the product of factors so some product of some literals or numerical value to the literals the so terms are formed are formed is the product of of factors so what are the factors we should know so let's uh, generally uh, four is there what are the factors of four two is the factor one is one factor four is also and the factor now so first thing we will recap little bit algebra comes from 
uh, Arabic word algebra the reunion the, the reunion the meaning is the reunion of broken parts al khwarizmi gave this al khwarizmi is arabic mathematician and algebra the operation of literals here called algebra diophantus is considered as the father of algebra terms factors coefficients we should learn about these things so in this also terms factors and coefficients are there so first we will uh, we will take an example 4x plus 5 is an expression so in this uh, what are the terms here what are the terms here 4x the terms are 4x comma 5 these are all terms and uh, terms are added to form what uh, expressions terms themselves can be formed as the product of factors generally 4x is there 4x is the fact uh, product of factors what are the products product of factors 4 and uh, 5 so term is uh, this this term is formed by the product of product of 4 and 5 4 and uh, sorry x sorry 5 not 4 5 is a means 10 4 and x product of 4 and x the term is uh, ma made up of just one factor 5 so this 5 is uh, pro is for uh, is just one factor it has uh, only 5 so the expression 7xy minus 5x are two terms so suppose we will write uh, the expression 7xy minus 5x are uh, the two terms uh, in this uh, uh, here terms what uh, th this is first example one this is second example now what are the terms here terms are 7xy comma 5x so uh, the factors of 7xy factors of 7xy what uh, uh, 7 this is x and this is y these are the factors of uh, 7xy uh, now the coefficient of numerical coefficient the coefficient of term of 7xy coefficient of 7xy is equal to 7 generally we will consider about the numerical coefficient 7 uh, similarly the coefficient of coefficient of minus 5x so the coefficient of minus 5x is minus 5 now there are uh, some of the expressions like monomials monomials means uh, the algebraic expression contains uh, one term is called monomial means algebraic expression the expressions containing algebraic expression expression that contains one term is called monomial algebraic expression uh, contains only one term is called monomial now we will learn about what is binomial binomial means what Uh, the express an expression containing uh, two terms the algebraic ex expression that contains expressions that contains two terms are called binomial so let's go come to the uh, examples of monomial what is the examples of the monomial 4x square this is one only contains one term on 3xy this is also one term minus 7z this is also one term 5xy square this is also one term 10y this is also one term so anything contains one term means that is monomial so any expression contains two terms means that is called uh, 
binomial expression so now a plus b this is a binomial 4l plus 5m this is also binomial a plus 4 this is also binomial let's come to the trinomial so now tell me what is trinomial guess what is trinomial yes you are right trinomial means the algebraic expression containing three terms expression containing three terms an expression expression contains three terms three terms are called trinomials trinomials so what are the expression contain three terms let's uh, come back to this uh, trinomials examples its uh, examples are now a plus b plus c that is a uh, three terms trinomial 2x plus 3y minus 5 this is also three terms x square y minus xy square plus y square this is also contains three terms three terms containing means that is called a trinomial so let's come back to the like terms and unlike terms like terms and unlike terms like terms and unlike terms so first uh, some of the terms will write uh, here, here in book only this example is given i will write that only 14x minus 13x means the page number 138 your page your textbook only in safety textbook uh, in that uh, like terms and unlike terms uh, some examples are given so we need to learn how to uh, how to uh, how to study the book first generally we are more uh, inclined depending on uh, more more often with teachers uh, due to these uh, TVs computers and uh, uh, these are diverting our interest in the and absorbing totally it will absorb our minds that's why what happens now this book reading habit is gone for the students if you got the book reading habit develop the book reading habit then uh, everything will be very easy and 7x minus 14x follow my class properly it will be like a home tips and if you are following it properly means are like terms and at the end of the end of the classes i will give you assignments the me i means i am saying about assigning a work assigning of a work means assignment that is a assignment means what that is a work which you need to complete to get a get after completing that work you will get some standard see 5x square and uh, minus 9x square see here 5x square is there minus 9x square is there these are some like terms are like terms next uh, 14x is there this is 14x this is uh, 7x is there this is one thing and minus 13x uh, this one uh, minus 13x uh, so there he told 4x oh yeah minus 13x these are also a like term 13 minus 13 is there means it's not a like term unlike terms it becomes next uh, uh 7xy minus 5yx 7xy minus 5yx 7 i'll write in squares so 7xy minus 5yx are like terms see here my son is studying very seriously oh shit what are you doing boy okay now come back to additions so like terms means uh, we can add subtract or, or multiply or divide or unlike terms means so we can multiply but uh, uh, this uh, additions we cannot do means additions means it, suppose i'll uh, add x plus y x plus y will be like this only but and suppose i'll multiply x into y x into y will write as x y 
suppose we will divide x divided by y this will be x by y only. and suppose uh, addition multiplication division what is left uh, subtraction subtraction means uh, suppose we will write x minus y it will be like this so, suppose i will take two times 2x plus x this will be added so to get 3x 2x minus x this will be subtracted to get uh, x so addition subtraction then after multiplication 2x into x 2x into x means what uh, 2x is square i have to write and that only if i divide 2x divided by x uh, 2x by x i will write x x cancels you will get 2 so these are uh, for like terms or on like terms operation like terms operation now this uh, some examples will take uh, he, he told that add 7x square minus 4x plus 5 and 9x minus 10 and 9x minus 10 so what we have to do uh, 7x square minus 4x plus 5 plus 9x minus 10 this will add means what happens uh, 7x square as it is 7x square will write 9x minus 4x plus 5x will write minus 10 plus 5 what uh, plus 5 we will write so this is this is a vertical method of additions this okay the, your example sums only i will follow i will gen generally i just like to follow ncrt textbooks why this will be given uh, from basics to harder sums so, so generally experts will uh, prepare these books now it's very valuable they will take they will uh, spend a lot of time to prepare these books example one but uh, we spend a lot of time what? in watching TVs, computers, cell phone videos. The cell phone, don't observe cell phone so much. It will take your total time. So more than more dangerous than TV and everything, cell phones are more dangerous. We are, we are more uh, time we are spending on cell phones by chit chatting with others, unnecessary chit chattings. So, so much time is wasted in this 4yz plus 9zx minus 4y next minus 3xz plus 5x minus 2xy due to this technological advancement uh, tvs computers cell phones uh, so many of us are not getting uh, uh, time to sp for spending in studies one of the things and other thing is uh, our activities activities also we can we, we should do we it's good only to do activities but after after our studies only whatever you want to keep the activities time na, after you completion of your work only we should keep now IIT foundation classes I am saying it, it will take some one two to two hours it will take for mathematics only physics it will take some time chemistry you have you have to spend some time so for that we have to keep aside and with the regular work of the school means the general physics and chemistry maths we will spend time means it will cover other subjects also means at least maths and science it will cover so generally math and science work only uh, in any school they will give more work on math and science language uh, subjects work like hindi or english uh, a little bit less work only it will be there so or uh, social social means a little bit content is there we have to study a lot next uh, let's uh, do this some um, okay what i wrote here uh, okay example one we are doing now we I involved in talking with the you now I forgot this okay now what is 7xy plus 5yz minus 3zx is there this one you have to write 7xy 
Now, now I'll tell. Uh, I will do in vertical method. This is the vertical method. Seven x y plus five y z minus three z x. Next, plus four y z, four y z plus nine z x plus nine z x. Minus four y minus four y. Next what? Uh, minus uh, uh, minus two x y minus two x y plus five x plus five x. You have to write here and uh, minus three minus two x y. See minus two x y is there. This one x y down x y only we should write here. Five x is there. Five x lifetime is not there at all. So. Uh, this minus three x z is there. Minus three x z means uh, three z x and three. Uh, this both are same. Minus three x z we should write. Then after we have to add it. Add all. Seven x y minus two x y what uh, plus five x y. Five five y z plus four y z. This is actually nothing is there means plus is there. Remember that. Four, five plus four plus. Nine y z. Nine uh, nine minus three is six. Six minus three is plus three x z minus four y plus five x. So this is uh, this is what the answer we will get. Now another another sum is there. Example one is over. Example two is there. Example two. So example two. Subtract, subtract five x square. Subtract five x square minus four y square. Five x square minus four y square. Plus six y minus three. Plus six y minus three. From 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 seven x square minus four x y plus eight y square plus eight y square plus five x minus three y plus five x minus three y. This one see whenever you will say subtract uh, th this expression from this expression. Uh, this expression we have to write minus this expression we have to do. See vertical method only we are using now. Uh, uh, so first we will write seven x square minus four x y as it is. How it is there I am writing again. Plus five x. This is question, na. That's why. Then after this expression minus this expression. What is this expression? See, whenever you are writing this, uh, x square down x square we have to give. Seven x square is there. We have to write five x square here. Minus four x four y square. Where should we write? Below five y square. Next. Plus six y is there. Six y is there, ah. Uh. Here three y is there. Like times below like times we have to write. So next minus three is there. Minus three is not there. This constant term is not there at all. So minus three right last. Okay. Now here we have to subtract now. You see change the symbol. Minus this becomes plus. This becomes minus. This becomes plus. And seven x square minus five x square. Two x two x square. Minus 4xy plus 12y square plus 5x minus 9y plus 3. This is uh, 2x square minus 4xy plus 12y square plus 5x minus 9y plus 3. This is uh, somewhat uh, some more examples I will discuss in next video.